certain evident that we're not doing that out here in these communities. We're not keeping God's laws. What did he tell us would happen if we neglected to keep his laws? Go to Deuteronomy 28 and verse 15. Let me give you the understanding of why our communities are the way that they are. Why it's death and murder constantly. Why brothers and sisters hate each other. Hey, my brother, won't y'all pull up, man? Come get a little of this word, bro. Y'all got some questions or something? Come build with your brothers. What's your question, brother? The Lord out here in the streets. Watch this. Go to Proverbs chapter 1 and verse 20. Watch this. Let me bring it out for you. Let me show you what the, the scripturally exactly what you just said. Read what you got. Proverbs chapter 1 and verse 20. Wisdom crieth without. Wisdom crieth without. Where is that? She uttereth her voice in the streets. No, in the church house. In the streets. No, in your own house. In the streets. Wisdom utter her voice in the streets. Right here on 33rd and Roanoke. This is where God, he, his presence is right now amongst these brothers trying to wake our people up to their heritage according to the scriptures. Hey, my brother, how you doing, bro? It's good to see you, my brother. You got any questions, man? <clears throat> Hey, all praise to the most high. So you Go got, back to Deuteronomy. You got light shining. All praise to the most high, brother. Respect, I see you. So you have an understanding of what we out here trying to teach our people. Go to Deuteronomy chapter 28, verse 15. Hey, what's going on, OG? I see you, brother. You got any questions as well, bro? No, no, no. Just look. Watch this. Read this. Deuteronomy chapter 28 and verse 15. But it shall come to pass, if thou will not hearken unto the voice, of the Lord thy God. Now it says, if you do not listen to the voice of the Lord thy God, read, to observe, to do all his commandments and his statutes, which I command thee this day, that all these curses shall come upon thee and overtake thee. If you do not keep God's commandments, That's right. all these curses shall come upon thee and overtake thee, right? We got police cars out here right now. This is part of being cursed. Now we have to have another nation of people come and govern us because we refuse to keep the laws that God gave us from the beginning. Go to verse 45. Verse 45. Moreover, all these curses shall come upon thee and shall pursue thee and overtake thee till thou be destroyed. Right, now watch this, brother. Now, you said that God is in the streets, right? I and I just, he's, he's everywhere, right? <laughs> now, he just said that we have to have commandments and we must keep his commandments, right? If we didn't keep his commandments, we will be cursed. Let me show you some of the commandments, brother, that we're not keeping that causes us to be cursed. Go to go to uh, 1 Corinthians 11. Let me show you something that you can fix right now today, brother. You yourself personally. All right, watch this. I understand it, but see that Bible right there? Chapter 11 and verse 4. Watch this. First Corinthians, chapter 11 and verse 4. Now what's your name, brother? Old school. Old school, I want you to listen very closely to thus saith the Most High God. Watch this. Every man praying or prophesying, having his head covered, dishonoreth his head. Now what you're going to understand is what we're doing right now is prophesying. It says every man praying see, see, that's, see, or that's, prophesying see, that's what I don't having right his there. head covered. See, that's what I don't understand right there. This honor of his own head. Prophesy. You understand that? Well, this book is a prophesy. book of prophecy. Watch this. Everything that's written in this book <laughs> is prophecy. No revelation. Revelation chapter 18. Chapter 19 and verse 10. And I fell at his feet to worship him. And he said unto me, See thou do it not. I am thy fellow servant and of thy brethren that, that have the testimony of Jesus. Worship God. For the testimony of Jesus is the, prophet, is the spirit of prophecy. This book that we're reading, this Bible is the spirit of prophecy. Right? When we read the spirit of prophecy, every man under the sound of the spirit on the word of this prophecy must have his head uncovered. This is the law. These are laws that we break consistently, that we do not keep. 
This is why we stay cursed. Go back to Deuteronomy 28. Deuteronomy chapter 28. Verse 45 again. Thank you, fellas. Deuteronomy chapter 28 and verse 45. Moreover, all these curses shall come upon thee and shall pursue thee and shall overtake thee till thou be destroyed because thou hearkenest not unto the voice of the Lord thy God. Because we refuse to keep God's laws, statutes, and commandments, it is very evident that we have been destroyed. Nation is men leading by example.